So now that we did the easy gems, it's time to get a little crazy with some crystals. Are you ready to go crazy for crystals? Okay, if you notice looking at this, you see that they're all jetting out all different ways. And if you notice, the tops are very similar to those first really easy gems we did. So grab your paper and your straight edge. And definitely, I would do a pencil on this. I, of course, am going to do the marker so you can see it. The best way to start is with just a little bit of a zigzag line. So give me a zigzag line and everything is gonna grow off of that. So the first one I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna take one of these points and I'm just gonna make two lines going up. Now we need to make the top. This top, I'm gonna make a little special. I'm gonna give it a little flat end on the top. And then that top I have to turn into a triangle. Now from this point, we're gonna make two lines going down and they need to be a little longer than those right there. Then we connect everything. So connect them. And then from there, we're gonna take these points and take them down. Now, everything is going to overlap each other. So this is our first one, and everything else is going to be behind it and around it. So now let's go over here, and again, do two sides. Try to make them about the same. And then after we make the sides, we're going to make a triangle on the top. And once you have your triangle on the top, we're again going to make two or three lines coming down from here. Let's do three, and you want to make them a little lower than right here. So we're going to go one, two, three. And then we need to connect these again, just like we did on that very first jewel. So connect your top up. Now we're gonna take each of these lines and have them go straight down. So now we have two pieces of crystal jetting out. Let's do a third one over here. This roller is not the best. We'll do one side and the other side. And then we need to do the tops again. And we're gonna do mostly triangle tops. And after you have your triangles, we're gonna do two or three lines again right here. I'm gonna do two. And remember, they always need to be a little longer than the outside side ones. And connect them. And then we're gonna connect those points down again. Now, where else do you wanna put them? You can put them wherever else you want on here. I'm gonna put one out here. And you can make them at different angles. And this one is gonna have two lines coming out. And again, connect these. And then you need to bring these two lines down. And you can just keep going crazy on this. I'm gonna add another one here. And remember, your crystal doesn't have to look like my crystal because every crystal is different. Just make sure you connect all your lines. And I'm gonna do one, baby one over here. Now your bottom, you could just leave it like this, or if you want, you can kind of make it like this one, the way it looks like it's come out of something. 
And this, you could keep making more crystals. If you wanted, you could just make this whole thing crystals all the way to the end. I'm gonna kind of take the easy way out and just form some rock going here. because I think it'll be fun to have this to paint. And there you go, some crazy crystal coming out.